restorations. Search within, God within, embrace the wholeness and face the truth. No more victimhood, but acceptance. Love and desire is not easy. You don't have to force to get what you want. Discerning lie hides from the truth. Restoration. Restoration. Restore the balance. Restore your children. Restore the balance. Restoration. Heal us, God. Restoration. Heal us, God. Restoration. Heal us, God. Restoration. Hey, everyone. This is, I don't know, I lost track of the day, but happy another day. Happy prayer. Happy prayer for not just LGBTQI plus, plus, but for everyone. That's what the plus means for me. And I'm sticking to it. So, uh, happy campaign for me. Happy Pride. Happy Humanity Day. <laughs> well, month. So, I'm out here again doing a little bit of my campaign. But, uh, I'm going to exercise. Uh, just absorbing this good old air and nature uh, while I'm here. And to bring awareness that... Sometimes it's just good to go out in nature to reset and not to live in the confinements of a status quo or a title. Yes, I know it's, it's LGBTQIA+, but it's, it's just meaning for me it's the spectrum of lifestyles I'm living. And I'm going to continue to push this campaign because it's bring awareness to everyone that know that God and Christ you know if you believe in Christ or whatever but knowing that the source of creation loves you unconditionally and loves you as you are created you differently on purpose we're all different look out in nature the, all the different animals the beings the ex-sexual beings the, the heterosexual beings the homosexual beings um, maybe even beings that don't have any type of sexual relations just understand that you are you on purpose. It's deliberately. You're not a mistake. You're not an abomination. Uh, we all have our own paths to go in this life, to follow. And I think people, some people get tied up with, with doctrines, uh, canon doctrines especially, and wanting to judge any judge another for being different when you should be accepting and embracing other people's differences. That's what makes this world vibrant and and dynamic. It's the knowledge or the knowing that there are species and people of the same species that are different from one another. That we all are different in our own way. We are all special. So yeah, I just Wanted to bring that awareness to everyone to encourage people to go out and more in nature and to get a reset and just, just soul search within yourself to know that God is within you and around you. The kingdom is in you and around you and that you really don't have to be anyone else but yourself. You don't, you don't even have to be like yourself. Just be. Just be. That's what nature is telling you just to be. So, um, just knowing that you don't have to be anything unless you want to be it, you know, just don't ever lose sight of who you are. Reclaim your power. That's what Jesus wanted us to, to know, to do in these, to not, to look to anyone else to discern when we are deserving of grace to know 
that it's important to have that connection with the most high, with the source of creation, with your higher self, the universe, whatever you want to identify it as, or whatever you identify this existence as. Some say it's an illusion, and or it's a fabrication, it's the matrix, whatever. But just know to not lose yourself in the process of trying to fulfill what others dictate or try to tell you that you should be. Just be. Live in peace and respect to the next person. And enjoy it. Enjoy life. Alright. You gotta go.